So I'm at the store, and I see this, uh, I'm at Kohl's, I think I'm at. The Food Network has its own, you know, kitchen products. Anyway, it's this, uh, it's by the company called Chef, Chefin. I know we've reviewed one of their products before. I don't, I think it's my, the chopper was it? The veggie chopper? I don't know. Anyway, it's called the stripper. That's right. Da 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 da. No, I'm just kidding. So this is it. But before we show you this, it's got different sizes for different vegetables. Before I test this out, I'm going to talk about what I have here. I got a poultry herb blend. I'm going to try it on thyme, rosemary, and even sage. Sage is leaves, so you're still going to have to probably pull those off. But we're going to pull through anyways. So this is kale that I bought. And this, look at this. This is organic kale. So much more here than here. This is regular kale, organic. Be careful because I, I bought both of these for the test because this is bigger than this. I want to see if we can get all kale to be pulled through. But these were the same price. That's right. This was on sale for, I don't know, 79 cents a bundle or something. But these cost the same. So if you can go organic and not pay a price increase, grab the organic. I usually grab this one. I got the biggest stem I could find to see if this really works. Does it go through? Oh my gosh, it does go through. Look at that. The biggest hole, bink. All right, you guys ready? All right, here we go. Whoop. Did you take it all off? Oh yeah. Yeah, it leaves the smallest stuff, but that's how, when I'm trimming my, my kale, that, that, that's totally fine. It should break it off right about there because that's all good to eat. So let's do it again. Pull right through. Oh, no. Didn't work. Broke it off too soon. Here we go. Nope. Broke it off again. All right, well, I'm doing it correctly, so let's give it one more try. Okay, here we go. And maybe we gotta do it fast. Whoop. Well, that worked, but my kale went on the floor. Hang on a minute. All right, so let's do one more now. Now that I know to do it fast, we're gonna give it a try. Here we go. This is just regular kale, ready? Let's see, did it take it all off? Yes, it did. Does it save time? Yes. Does it save you from using a knife and possibly cutting yourself as you're trimming these? Yes. So if you're not comfortable with a knife, you can use this device for this, but it may not work 100% of the time. Okay, so this is made for time. I'm just not sure if you pull it, which way you pull it. So we're going to, and time has a very strong stem. So we're going to put it in the biggest one here and try and pull it through. Okay. So here we go. <laughs> I'm doing it slow. And it's stuck. All right, I'm doing it fast now. Ready? <clears throat> Okay, see what happened, it bundled up, but it didn't, did it take it all off? Oh, it did take it all off. Yeah, there's no stem left. Oh, it did work. Ha, 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 there it is, go. Cool. Okay, well that worked. I have no idea if this is, I know this isn't meant to be for sage, but let's just slowly pull it through and see what happens. Oh, maybe we'll go through a bigger one. Nope. Oh my gosh, look, it took all the leaves off. I don't think this is gonna work for rosemary, and it's not supposed to, but I'm going for it. I'm feeling lucky today. So let's get a, just a simple pass through and see. We'll put it right through here. There's rosemary right there. Oh, did you see that? All right, let me do it again. No way, this is a lucky day for me. I am so excited. All right, you ready? Watch this, watch carefully. There it is. It's the greens stripper. I will be using this on the show. I'm gonna use it for my herbs. I'm, and if you're wondering what I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make kale and herbs and mushrooms and I'm gonna saute it all. It's gonna be a great side dish. But, uh, but yeah, so it works 75% on the kale and it worked 100% on all the herbs. Totally surprised about the sage. I did not think that was gonna happen. The rosemary, no, no way. But it did it all. 
So congratulations to Chefin who creates this and the Food Network who I got it at Kohl's. I, you could probably buy this online. Uh, I'll put links down below for Amazon, Walmart, or wherever you can find it. Uh, it'll be below if you want to get one of these. All right? Guys, take care, and I'll see you on the next episode.